Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to Day to My Budget. My name is Nita and I'm on a journey to becoming a financial warrior. That means staying there free and giving myself financial options with the help of the cash envelope system, savings challenges, and zero-based budgeting. Today I'll be stuffing my savings challenges in the amount of $311. Before I begin, I wanted to say thank you guys so much for your continued support, all the new subscribers, and... I just appreciate you all so much, and I hope you continue to enjoy. Let's not waste any time. Let's get this cash counted. And if we have 150, 70, 90, 210, 230, 250, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 300, 5, 10, 11. So we do have exactly what's needed. We're going to start here with the 100 envelope challenge, and we're going to stuff two numbers, and that's going to be 65 and 40. When I first started, the even the thought of doing the 100 envelope challenge, it was intimidating, but I had a plan i stuck to it and my plan was to stuff two numbers a week and in the amount of 105 so 105 every week 105 for my paycheck 105 for my side hustle and so i stuck to the goal chipped away at it and we are down to pretty much this and these if you can stick to your plan, I think, you know, it's doable. Um, so, but anyway, let's get these envelopes stuffed. We'll stuff 40 first. So, 20 and two twenties for 40. And 65. We have 50. 60 and 5. Next, we're going to get into the Biggie Small challenges. And we're going to start with uh, what's it like outside. And I, for me, it's weather Wednesdays. And for the month of September, let me put this up here. Actually, with the the fifth month, I mean, sorry, the fifth week of a month, it kind of throw this challenge off like a week ahead or a week behind. So this time, I'm a week be a week ahead. So last the first Wednesday that I'm counting um, for September was August thirty first. And that was a stormy day. And the next, this past Wednesday was sunny for 25. So a stormy day is 10. And then sunny is 25 for 35. So just going to write 31st and then... Last Wednesday was what? Was the sixth? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. anyway, I'll fix this later. I'll put this in the wrong spot, but we'll get this stuff so we can keep it moving. Um, let's see. Um. None of these challenges I count until it's finished. So we have 20, 30, and 5. Next is the penny challenge. I'm going to stuff this penny with $11. So we have 10 and 11. Okay. 
Next, we have the Owl Savings Challenge. And this challenge is going to get 50. And I'm going to color this 10, 20, another 10 that's 40, 3, 6, 8, 50. Okay, so what we're going to give it is cash first. And I'm going to give it this $100 bill. Take the 50 out. All right, you guys. So that is done. We are so close to finishing. I think there's like $50 remaining. Next, we have the Sunflower Challenge. This one is going to get $20. Yes. So, we'll just get this one colored in. This one is going to my sick days. Um, it's like my sick days is starting my medical fund for this year. But it's not really for like paying for my sick days if I take take time off work and you know might not feel like cooking might not feel like doing much um so any expenses that kind of throw my budget off for the week or the the days off so I can stay on track um and that goes in here and this one I do count cuz I do um from month to month, I, you know, close out my budget and this envelope is counted. So we're adding 20 and I actually have an appointment coming up next week and my copay is 20 bucks and most likely I'm going to take it from here, but I may take it from my buffer just so this can continue to grow. So it has 1, 52, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. So 340. Yeah, I actually have a like two um appointments coming up. Just trying to knock out my yearly or annual physicals and checkups and all that. And my copay is 20 bucks. So um that is it for the biggie small challenges. There is one we're going to complete a seasonal challenge. And we are finishing up summer. Um, so I had to add uh, 15 to the cone because when I added the remaining numbers, or add, you know, I added all the numbers, and the seller looks like she forgot to <laughs> add. The challenge was for 15, so I budget my challenges. So when I went back and added the budget um, for this challenge for summer, I was like, wait, I know I should be almost finished. Like why? The numbers weren't matching up. So I had, I just counted the cash, which led me to know that, you know, to count this. So, but anyway, um, this challenge is going to get 55. So we have 50. And five. So this should be 250. So let's see. 1, 20, 40, 60, 80. One fifty, seventy, ninety, two ten, two thirty, two forty, forty five, fifty. Okay. So let's get this color in. Yay. So we have one season left, which is fall, my favorite. So we'll be starting this, the next stuffing. And I think that's one thing I've uh, realized, like doing challenges and stuff. I'm kind of... 
realizing like I want a challenge that that goes all year, like weekly, and then I want one like seasonal. And so next year I definitely have another seasonal challenge. I don't know, maybe a scratch off. I'm in the process of creating new scratch off um, challenges. So I think I want to do a seasonal scratch off challenge. So um, this goes towards my rainy day. It's expected fun. And I'm going to put this to the side and we'll stuff this in my next video. Last two things that's going to get something is in my personal binder. And speaking of wellness, y'all know if y'all see this watch, when I finish this video, I'm going out to get sexier. I'm going for my run. I try to get um, cardio in outside of the gym at least twice a week. But um, it's usually I go three, three times. But if I go twice, I'm good. But three times, even better. So plan arrives is going to get 15. And I keep moving my pen, you guys. What? And, and I'm hiding it from myself. Like, why, why are you doing that? Okay. So, we have 15. Which costs off a planner. And these I will count as well. So, we have one, two, three, four, five. Five planners left. Looking forward to that. Because I got things I want to buy. And it has 1, 52, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 3, 5, 10, 15, 25, 30. So 330. <laughs> yeah. And the last one, I think it's beauty. Yeah, it is beauty. So I'm thinking originally I was. Uh, Looking forward to buying a human hair wig so I can give my hair a break. Um, I mentioned before, like I sweat a lot and then, you know, I'm constantly sweating because I'm, when I'm not at the gym, I'm running, you know, so it's always a sweat session going on. So I wanted to give my hair a break and... You know, cornrow it up and throw me a wig on. But I need it to look like my hair and my scalp. I need that. So, I know that's going to be expensive. But now, I'm thinking about getting a brow procedure where, you know, because I, I mean, I have hair there. But, you know, it's thin. It's, it's like, yeah, we need help. So, I want to help them out. Um, and... My sister and I thinking about getting that done. So, either way, it has a plan. We got that. And so this has 10, 20, 30, 40, oh, <laughs> 100, 20, 40, 60, 80. 200, 10, 20, 25, 30. So, 230. What's that? Need 120? Okay. And that is it, you guys. Oh, that's my alarm telling me it's time to, to go run. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. But yes, I will catch you all in the next video, which... Most likely be my budget with me, um, but I'm gonna and I'm gonna stuff this in my paycheck, the first paycheck of September video. Thank you guys so much, and I will catch you in the next few videos. Bye guys.